We have a couple interesting areas here. You can see the heavily oxidized area. It's about uh, five, six meters wide. This is a sericite schist here. And you have little stringers of quartz throughout uh, some of the foliations of your schists. And right here, we have this exposed, which is a larger quartz vein amongst the schists. You can see how pyrotized it is. So this is about uh, 50 centimeters wide. This definitely comes in there at some point, probably underneath that. And it's exposed in a couple spots over here as well. These are all schistos portions of the road and then down around the bend there you have another area that's like this but quite a bit wider. So this is the second zone right here. You can see the, the schistos rock and you can see the giant quartz vein right here. Doesn't appear to be much in this quartz vein other than the occasional speck of iron pyrite but that's a good good sized vein that's 30 centimeters. Um, continues up there. Looks like you got another secondary vein coming in here. So you got quite a bit of uh, quartz veining. Smaller ones and larger ones. You can see again the rock and you can see the oxidization here of all the, the schists. So there's definitely something going on in this zone. It's got to be definite mineral in here. Looks like there's a bit more quartz in there. And this continues all the way down. This is about a, a 30 meter wide zone. And you can see the heavy oxidized schists on the wall there. Another quartz vein there. So... There is a uh, definite pyrite in this, but uh, this would definitely need a lot more exposing to get down to what's actually in here. Anyway, short little video, hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you think in the comments about this zone. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. You know the deal.